Yo, welcome back to another video. It's your boy EJ with NBO Kill. Nothing before family bullets, man. I wanted to just get a video of him because I'm, you know, the dude is so big, though, man. Y'all, and Navy was in the backyard. I let Navy in the backyard like around four this morning, four, maybe five this morning. One of my chickens wasn't in the pen. One of my chickens wasn't in the pen. So I didn't know that. So around nine this morning, you know, I went out there, or well, just a minute ago, because around 9 a.m. right now, I went out there to open up the door to let Navy in, because I got Navy spend time in the house. So when I went out there with a man, I see the chicken beside the pen ran down. I'm like, bro, Navy didn't kill the chicken. Bro, Navy didn't do nothing to the chickens, bro. Bro. Navy cool with chickens? Oh, man. He might be the best dog in the world, man. Come on, Roxy. Roxy. Hey, girl. Hey, mom. Come on. Hey, Roxy. Hey, girl. Roxy. Hey, girl. Hey, mom. Come on. Come on, mama. Come on, hi, girl. I know I got some of the best dogs. If not the best dogs. My dogs lit, man. My dogs are beautiful. They're structurally sound. They're playful. They're energetic. And they built up. They all muscled up. All my dogs muscled up. Ouch. But yeah. So. So yesterday I gave all the dogs a bath, y'all. Every last one of them. I watched them all. Didn't videotape because I had nobody hold the camera. And it's just quicker to get things done whenever you just do them, you know what I'm saying? Instead of just setting cameras up and trying to get all that stuff situated. It's just easier to just do it, you know what I'm saying? So, that's what I did yesterday. And, um, anyway, so when I was doing it yesterday, my point of me mentioning that I watched all the dogs is that Katana coat is way longer than everybody else's. Everybody else has a thin coat, real thin layer, like, that's why they don't have a problem outside, cause like that. Like if you look at Roxy, right? Just for example, you see this? If you look at her coat, I don't know if you can tell, but it's not. Come on, Mama, golly. But you look, it's not like the hairs. You look at the hairs; it's like super short. Her hair is super short. Super short, like. You can't even grab the hair. It's so short on, on her. Zeus is a little bit longer than hers. Katana's long. Katana has a longer coat. So it got me a little worried. I'm like, dang, why is, first off, why is her coat so long? These are these are extensions of pit bulls, you know what I'm saying? They just bigger, thicker, um, 
more more human friendly um pit bulls man but um yeah her coat well it's a little longer come on it's a little longer why are you doing all that mama it's a little longer back here but it's still thing but my leg is like nothing like swear you hear me hey Come on. She's so fast, y'all. So it'll be, it'll happen so fast, it'd be hard to get her to stop. But I just hope she don't. I just hope she don't. Well, she know what no means, right? Oh. Yeah, look at these dogs, man. There's boys available and there's one female available. All the lighter ones are boys. Go on, get your dog, man. It's a dog, check the dog out. Roxy, no. Don't even think about it. Go use the bathroom. Why don't you just go pee? I mean poop. Look at my look at my boy, y'all. Look at my crazy boobies. Y'all, they be fighting too, y'all. I ain't kidding. They be tripping. Look at my chickens running around. They probably finna go in that pen. No, uh, uh, Roxy. Roxy, no. Y'all better get to safety. You see this big old dog running around while y'all just running around doing y'all thing? They were like, man, Navy was just out here. If Navy ain't gonna do nothing, I know nobody else gonna do anything. Man. Your dog, man, you look for XL, try. It's what you want right here. You wanna ride with me? I think I'm gonna take Zeus with me today. You can go tomorrow, okay? I think I'm gonna take Zeus with me today, baby. Hey, baby. Hey. Hey, baby. Hey, sweetheart. Come on, let's go. I know you're gonna wait till you, I know, I know you're gonna wait until you get in that kennel and poop. It is, it's so confusing that you do that. Zeus. The tunnel out, the tunnel might go bite one of them chickens. Cause she young, you know what I'm saying? She, no, she young. She got to play. And uh, I for sure know she uh she run back there. Even if she not trying to hurt them or nothing like that, she be trying to you know playing with them too rough. And we all know chickens are pretty fragile, man. Uh, scoop that out of poop. Um, as soon as I did it, a couple of them poop, like I just told y'all in the last clip, there's no way to keep this thing 100% clean, man. Once you clean it, they gonna poop. That's just what it is. You gotta go back in there and pick it up again. I wanna show y'all something, man, with the whole food thing, man. Whenever you feed your dogs, you wanna have it high. You wanna have the food high. If they not stretching to get it, it's not gonna help them. You see how she's stretching, she's on her tips. You see that? If they're not stretching to get it, look at that. Watch how she do it. Make it where they barely can get the food. They have to stretch to get it. That's the only way it's gonna help them. If they, if this, I don't care if it's up or not. If they putting their head down to get it, it ain't helping. They have to stretch to get it. See how she barely can get in the water? You gonna see this water. Stretch, stretch, see that? Stretching. Stretch, see? She's on her toes, y'all, not her feet. See how she's not on her feet? She's not on her feet, she's on her toes. 
toes. They have to stress to get that food, man. If they're not stressing to get it, it ain't helping them. Hey, big guy. Stretch. Stretch. Exactly. They have to stretch. It, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter if it's, if it's off the ground or not. If they're not stretching. If they're not stretching their feet to get it, it's not, you're not doing anything. All the food up high. Stretch to get it. Stretch. Watch the turn. There you go. Y'all see that chest? Watch the turn. Watch the food house. You gotta stretch to get it. Almost where they can't get it if they sit flat. If they feet flat, they can't eat. Look, stretch. You gonna get the stretch. Let's see what I'm talking about in a second. You see that chest though? No stagnant, real chest spread. Girl, get up and eat. Pissing, dookie, dookie. I'm gonna spray this thing out in a second, so. Come on, y'all. Mainly because I pay attention to pedigrees and I pick the right dogs, but I take care of them too. You want to eat, you got you got stress to get it. Everybody, even the puppies. <laughs> even the puppies gotta get off their feet to get the food. I'm just getting them used to having to go get it. You know what I'm saying? It ain't just on the ground, you gotta go get it. Uh, let me finish cleaning up the kitchen and that's because we want to show you guys that. Hey! Hey! They were choking. Slow down, boy. Turn cold already. Are they already going green? Hey. 
You don't want to have the messed up eyes. Now the gate's some antibiotics, your eye healed, and you already still trying to fight again. When will you learn, buddy? Go get some water. Hey, yo. Yo. Hey, y'all need to hear about these dogs, man. Cause feeding these dogs is a chore. I run through a 40, 40 pound bag of dog food every two days. So you can't imagine, I gotta go back to the feed store and get more dog food. I mean, I still have like a half a bag left. You know what I'm saying? I know to feed them, everybody for like maybe another day and a half. I say every, okay, let me go back. Every, every three to four days, 40 pound bag of dog food. So these dogs eat 40 pounds every three to four days. So two bags a week. At fifty dollars a bag, so it's a hundred dollars a week on food. And as you guys know, it's only gonna go up. The bigger they get, the more food they're gonna eat. I say about another couple weeks, I'll be up to three bags a week, and then you know how it go. But yeah, make sure you like, come and subscribe for more videos. This is the last video. This is the end of the video. Also, um, I really do. Uh, I really do appreciate y'all, man. This has been a beautiful ride, y'all. Beautiful ride. Beautiful, beautiful ride. But this is my first year breeding, y'all. And I'm telling y'all, I have I have accomplished so much within this year. I couldn't imagine. As you guys know, last year, um, I was in Georgia. Um, all I had was four dogs, four or five dogs. And then I got all these dogs. Like, it doesn't take a lot of time, man. Once you get into this game... Once you buy your dog, everything happens fast. Next year, these dogs are gonna be ready to breed. Next year, these dogs are gonna be ready to breed. Next year, you're gonna have a pet. If you buy a dog now, next year, next fall, you will have your own pet. That's crazy how fast this happens, man. But anyway, make sure you like, comment, subscribe for more videos. It's your boy EJ with NBF Kennel, man. I really do appreciate you guys so much for tuning in. Um, it's like every video is almost in a thousand views in a couple of days. Like, this crazy to me, bro. I remember I used to get 17, 18 video views in a matter of like a month. We hitting thousand every day. This is amazing. This is going up. We almost had 40,000 subscribers. Can you guys believe that? Look at what y'all are doing, man. Every time you guys like, comment, subscribe, it shows the video. It shows my videos to more and more people. I don't think nobody upload as much as I do. I'm not saying that it means anything, but what I'm starting to see is a trend of uh, breeders on YouTube, and I'm starting to see it more and more often, and it's beautiful, man. We're, we're really expanding so much. Like, my videos are being watched in so many different countries, bro. That goes to show that we really put in work, and that's all you got to do is get up every day and put in the work. The money gonna come. Don't worry about the money right now. Don't try to calculate how much money you're gonna make. It doesn't work like that. This is a full-time job, man. I've cleaned all the kennels. I washed all the dogs, right? Um, some of the dogs back dirty. Some of the kennels back dirty. Just that quick. Just that quick. It's a full-time job, man. But it's beautiful, man. It's very rewarding, man. I can be buying so much stuff with the money I made off these dogs. But as you guys know, whenever you start a business, whatever you have a business, the first five years is just reinvesting into your business. If you're not reinvesting into your business, you're not going to grow, man. You're not going to grow. This is an investment business. You have to continue to invest for the next five years. I don't see myself making any money as far as um, you guys won't see. You guys won't see the money, right? You guys can't see the money because. I will continue to invest back into the business. I will continue to invest back into the business, man. And that's the beauty of, of owning dogs. That's the beauty of, of starting a business is that people don't see the money that you're making. People don't see what you're, the, the progress that you're making immediately. But you know, your family know, your family can feel it. Your family can feel it. The, the fact that I can 
any one of my sisters, anybody can call me and ask me for two or three hundred dollars, and I'm able to do it. I'm able to do it, y'all. I can buy whatever I want to buy right now. Well, I'm not gonna say I can buy whatever I want to buy because the ultimate goal is to buy rent. Um, I talked to a guy the other day. He on ten acres for like hundred twenty thousand dollars, and he does owner finance, but he wants fifty thousand dollars down. So it's just we 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 um we got a goal to hit, y'all. We got a goal to hit, man. We need to get at least hundred thousand dollars cash. Once we get that goal, we can run to the ranch, y'all. We move to the ranch. So uh, make sure you comment, like, share the video. Please, 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 please. Whatever you do, share the video. If you like the content I'm making, please like, comment, and subscribe. Please share the video with your friends and family. I do have dogs available, but these dogs are amazing. If you get one of these dogs, you are already 10 steps ahead of anybody else. Do not go spend $1,500 on no dog, y'all. Just don't go do it. I'm telling you. Save. Just save. Keep saving, man. Buy it's like this. If I go spend fifteen hundred dollars on a dog, I gotta breed that dog to a better dog, hoping that I get better puppies, sell those puppies, make the money that I make off selling those puppies, and then come buy one of my dogs. You know what I'm saying? I'm not saying that you don't that you, you can't do that. It's just when you buy one of my dogs, you already halfway there. You already halfway there. I've already put in the work. I've already invested the eight to ten to nine thousand dollars on dogs. So you guys are able to invest twenty five, thirty five hundred dollars on dogs to get to get where I am. If you get one of my dogs, you right there where I am. You right there where I am. You right there with me. And I love the fact that you can be right there with me right now. So we can all grow together. That's why I'm not selling my dogs for super expensive. I want you to be right there with me. The more puppies I sell to great homes, to great families the further the brand is pushed. You understand what I'm saying? And we're pushing the brand. I want NBF to be all over the place. I want so many people to have an NBF dog. Like everybody else got this dog. They talk about this and that. Trust me, y'all. I will be one of the biggest dog breeders. I will be one of the biggest dog names in the world. In the world. My my page, my views are being watched by different countries, y'all. NBF will be one of the best in the world. And you guys are part of this. And I, it means so much to me that I'm able to bring you guys along and be a part of this. So make sure you like, comment, and subscribe for more videos. Anything I can help you with, hit me up. 206-499-0422. Everything, all the pricing will be in the description. If you give me a call and you talk to me, you let me know what's your situation. Uh, let me know what your expectation, exactly what dog you're looking for. I can give you exactly the dog you need, the exact dog you need for your account. So um, it's best to just give me a call, man. Make sure you hit the like button. Make sure you share the button. Share, hit the share button. If you haven't subscribed already, make sure you subscribe to the channel, man. We're moving up, man. NBF is moving up. I love y'all so much, man. Thank you. Take care. Be nice to each other. Be very kind to each other. That's very important. That's very important that you be nice and kind. Do not talk crap about anybody else. As you guys know, if you watch my videos, if you're tuned in, subscribe. If you watch my videos, Everything I do in my videos, everything I say, it's on the internet. Like you will see other video, other YouTubers, other dog breeders doing exactly what I've just did, what I've just said. So that goes to show that the movement is working, the positivity is working. I'm changing lives, I'm changing um, camps. Even people that don't buy a dog from me, they're doing exactly what they see me do. They're doing exactly what they see me do, and it's beautiful. I love it. I love that. We're making an impact on uh, on on the bully world. We're making an impact on on dog breeding. We're making an impact on cleanliness. We're just making a huge impact. It, it's beautiful. It's no hate. I don't hate on anyone. I don't I don't hate the fact that people are copying me. That I don't hate that. I love that because I'm doing the right thing. If I was doing something wrong and people copy it, I'd be like, bro, don't do what I do. I'm not your mentor. I'm not that. But I'm doing the right thing. So I love the fact that it's being copied because. It's only going to progress the world. It's only going to progress the dog breed. It's only going to progress other people's camps, other people's lives, other people's families. It's beautiful. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Continue to copy me. I'm going to continue to copy what I see that's that's moving in the right direction. And we're going to do everything the right way, man. <laughs> There's no such thing as as um, as um copying somebody in, in a negative manner. If you're doing the right thing, people are supposed to copy it. It's, part, it's supposed to. You're supposed to copy good good behavior. 
you're supposed to copy um um good things that people are doing that that's that's a great thing i want you guys to copy i want you guys to do exactly what you see me doing and then add more to it i want to see something that i haven't seen before and i'm gonna copy that that's just the way the world works man nothing that's new nobody does anything new man we just do everything i'm just being consistent with what i'm doing and i love it i love you guys i love you guys so much thank you be kind to each other be nice to each other and i'll see you guys in the next video